और कैसे हो यहाँ पे गांड फट गई लेडीज एंड जेंटमैन कमिंग एट यू विद एन इमरजेंसी वीडियो बिकॉज वी आर नॉट गेटिंग जी के सिक्स That's right, but we still ended up getting a GTA 6 tease. I want to get right into it. Smash the like button for me to not waste any time, and I got a lot of stuff that I want to show you. There's a lot happening right now that uh, you need to see. Some old, but some new stuff came out. Now you see a VI logo. Now, ladies and gentlemen, drop a one if you think Rockstar is either teasing or trolling. I do think that they are teasing and trolling at the same time. Two, if you think that Rockstar is a billion-dollar company, it's an innocent company that do not know what they're doing. Do not bully the billion-dollar company. Billion-dollar company do not know what they're doing. Let let Bruh. me know if you think that. I mean, genuinely though, drop a two if you think that way. But I got a lot of stuff that I want to show you. But you gotta understand this. I posted this. I posted this innocent meme where this chick says that he dumped me. So I'm dating his landlord. We increasing the rent tomorrow. <laughs> Bumbo clap. This is one of those bumble clap moment. And then this man comes out of nowhere. So the Break and possibly GTA 6 logo tease from Rockstar. It looks like VI and N, but the flip VI shape seems intentional. Thanks, Gina. Oh shit! Oh shit! I don't know about this one. Should we pump the brakes or should we go all gas, no brakes? We apparently got this one as well. Now this is something that I covered not long ago, and I will link you a video where I talk more in depth about this one at the end. But apparently, gaming detective came out and said that below is an unreleased GTA Online T-shirt with a repeating downtown cab cop. pattern what's interesting is that the skyline is the background and that is not los santos and that is correct because you Bruh. see yeah you <laughs> you see this yellow cab out there with palm trees in the back and the skyline is that of you guessed it It is the skyline of the VI, the, right. the 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 Miami, the 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 White City. Also, not long ago, in fact, like years ago, we ended up getting this VI shape road. It's like GTA Virginia kind of situation. And when that happened, a lot of people like, yo man, that's GTA Six. And your mofo started actually. <laughs> They started uh, dropping VI on the road as well. This is seriously a bra moment. But we also ended up getting this house. This happened before the GTA 6 gameplay ended up leaking out, and now we know that this was really the the first real tease of GTA 6, the upcoming one, whatever they're gonna call it. My point here is that we're talking about a billion dollar company. They know what they're doing. They're doing this intentionally, whether you want to believe it or not. They they know what they're doing. This is a house. In Miami, with a UFO in the background, and in the beginnings, a lot of people thought that that's Cap. Okay, that's probably part of the GTA Defective Edition because this image was indeed dropped in GTA the Defective Edition. But now we know it is actually real. But however, we're apparently also getting their investor call on February 6th at 4:30 p.m. Eastern Time. I will surely live stream that. But here's the thing: this is where it gets a little bit sus, and a lot of people are really letting their dogs out. A lot of people are believing that this is gonna happen once again, and surely it can happen. But still, though, the chances are 50-50. Now, let me take you back to the time where it all began. Let me take you to last year when Rockstar came out and said that many of you have been asking about a new entry in the Grand Theft Auto series. They said that on February the fourth, but quickly after, they also ended up saying that we look forward. To sharing more as soon as we are ready, so please stay tuned on the Rockstar News uh, Wire. They dropped that on February the fourth, and the situation here is that this coming February the fourth, it will be a year. It's gonna be their one year anniversary. Can you actually believe oh, it? Shit. Oh, shit. I cannot believe that it's gonna be one year. And their investor call, they do their investor call every single quarter, and this year is no different. They're gonna start it off on February 6th. That's gonna be their first quarter call this year. And some people are also believing that, hey man, like we we might get something before because last year, two three days before their investor call, they actually, Bruh. yeah, last year they did officially announce the next Grand Theft Auto game, and then we all know. What happened? The gameplay leaked out. Lucia Bunda ended up leaking out, and a lot of people are believing that are they gonna be doing the same thing this year? Chances are 50/50. Surely during their live stream, there might be some more updates, might be more streams, which are, are more info, and I will surely live stream on the channel. So hit the bell. But here's the thing, man. They also posted this a month ago, which we know was for a GTA Online trailer. Yeah. They really cucked us hard, and we ended up getting cucked. But let's be real. I guess you expected. I expected. We all expected. One day, we're gonna see a tweet like this from Rockstar. 
either it's just gonna be a logo or it's just gonna be a gif or maybe a video like this and the day it drops we're gonna be like that's gta 6 but the fact that they did this already they were clearly trolling they clearly knew what they were doing the fact that we got cut so hard by this i genuinely believe that the day we end up getting a video like this a lot of people would be like nah man this is just a uh, gta all i dlc but ladies and gentlemen rockstar is also teasing the the trailer and announcement for gta 6 click on this video on the screen or click the video on the left because this karen goes crazy it's all the craziest video click on that and i will see you right there